Sandy Diao! <laughs> oh, I'm showing off my three Mandarin words. Now I think four because I got your last name. But more important, Sandy, your product, you know, the smart piano is going to bring soul to everyone's heart <laughs> and life. Whether you're six years old or 106, you're going to make people learn how to play the piano in 45 minutes. <laughs> well, and what could be a more generous gift in life than anything that brings music to someone's heart that they can create themselves and feel accomplished and listen to it and impress their friends and... <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's a magical thing. So tell us about this. Sure. Well, so we're our overarching company is called the One Music Group, and our products don't end at just the smart piano. Mm. We're thinking about other types of instruments in which we're able to bring technology into the instrument and make learning easier and more accessible for people. So specifically for the smart piano, we've got you know two different types. One is a portable version for the people who want to take it with them on the go. Oh. We also have a full-size version for someone who's really serious about getting into the hobby or wants something sort of like a home entertainment system or a center oh. that has it in their rooms. Um, and the way that it instructs you is a set of um, LED lights. Mm. And these lights guide your fingers to the exact uh, notes, give you real-time feedback, lets you know what you play right or wrong. And you can learn basically any piece of music you want, from pop to jazz to classical to rock and roll, R&B, you name it. And the reason we're doing that is because, you know, when you're taking private music lessons, you're going through scales, arpeggios, uh, boring things uh, for you. Know, <laughs> but everyone has a different role for learning music. Yeah, you don't yeah. need to take private lessons for 80 to $100. Exactly. You just want to learn one song. Yeah, yeah. it's That's like... Really Playing golf, you don't want to be on the driving range for 10 years. You know, you want to go out in the course and see all that. <laughs> so you found a way for us to start playing golf right at the first hour of, uh, of learning how to hold a club. Yeah, and, and that's remarkable to me. Now, now, you have a little keyboard, and, and I can go with the price for 200 bucks. So, so I get this keyboard with the LCD lights, and I just hook it up to my iPad or everything. And, you know, <laughs> I'm a classical piano or a, or a rock star. <laughs> right. Right. And, uh, and part of the LED lights being able to guide you through a song for the very first time you play in just a few minutes is that you get really, you get really excited. You're, you know, you're a because you hear it. You hear, hey, I'm playing music. <laughs> I, I can actually do this. I'm capable of making music. Yeah. It makes people feel good. It makes them want to continue practicing. Mm -hmm. it's, it's different than putting them through the traditional lesson. Oh. It's not their idea. It's their parents' idea. Now it's your idea. It's your goal. Absolutely. So it's just like a lot of education, I think, in, in this country is being that way. We're finding out we could learn more ourselves. You know, than, than school. The schools used to have this business locked up, and you know, like younger people, say, hey, uh, I just go online, learn it, figure it out, and do it. You know, and that's what you're doing. You're using the technology, giving us the technology for us to learn it ourselves, yeah, <laughs> and to use it. So, if we're not a classical piano, but we can enjoy that feeling. Every golfer is not a professional golfer, but they enjoy that. Yeah, you know? and that's what you're giving to us. Ah, true. You know, what happens there is the number of students in a classroom increase, the number oh, of teachers decrease. Yes. And now you can put, I don't know, maybe in the future you'll have 20 yes. of these smart pianos in the classroom. You have one teacher just kind of walking around. Right. You, you, don't, you don't need to be able, you don't need all those resources right. to be able to have students learn music anymore. All right, you don't even need a music teacher. <laughs> oh. So you say now, so music teachers, we don't even need a music teacher in school anymore if you have uh, your, your product here. Sure. Uh, we, don't, we don't even see ourselves as competitors to music teachers yeah. in any way. I think we all have the same goal. We want more people to learn music. We all want them to enjoy learning music, and we want them to pass that on to other people. So given that we're allies in this space, we want to help music teachers. Right now, they have a hard time scaling Absolutely. the classroom. They can't give enough attention to each student. I think technology can help them there. Absolutely. It is, and elsewhere, uh, elsewhere in the school, they're using technology with math classes, so why not with you know, uh, music classes? And the kids will get more out of it, too. Now, another interesting thing, you're at a furniture set. <laughs> 
a conference, a trade show. And you sold 400 of these things at a, a furniture trade show. That's phenomenal. And it's really part of your Indiegogo campaign that, that you got a, a couple more weeks yet. And, and people, if they get on the campaign and watch the videos, because it's great, that you could get the keyboard for like only 200 bucks. You can't get a keyboard that's decent for 200 bucks anywhere, I don't think. So you're able to do it because of the crowdfunding. And how much does the upright start at? The upright currently starts at 800. Wow, that's a deal, man. <laughs> that's a beautiful piece of furniture. I guess that's why you're there. Huh? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. And the way we kind of angle it is it's it's really got something for everyone in the family. Uh -huh. It's we call it a home entertainment system because you it's not one of those activities where you're sitting on a couch and watching movies right. or other things like that. Everybody's surrounding the piano. They're listening to someone play. There are games where you know multiple ah. people can sit at the piano. And there's even a little uh, player piano mode where you can just run through music oh. and it can kind of play for you. No kidding. Wow, that's right. <laughs> so let's sing happy birthday at the party. You just turn on your piano and it plays happy birthday and everybody sings to it. <laughs> exactly. Or replace that piano player at your wedding. And yeah. <laughs> now I don't need a playlist on my iPad. Yeah. <laughs> I just have the piano playing. Oh, that's terrific. But the keyboard, I mean, it seems like the keyboard for anybody, you know, for a gift, you know, you have a young child, you know, somebody just graduated this month or whatever, man, to take the, I, I know my boy in his 20s graduated college, he said, now I have time to really study music, you know, and so he, he did a trumpet, but he would love the piano. So if I, I would have got him $200 and is, do the piano, then he doesn't need a teacher to start uh, learning and stuff. Or, or retired people, you know, what the hell, they always want to learn the piano for, for 200 bucks they <laughs> they're bring up here too is uh, we actually have a partnership with a, uh, an organization and they're a nonprofit called um, uh, Older Adults Technology Services. Uh -huh. And we have a piano in one of their skills classrooms. And there are these, um, you know, retired uh, cin yeah. citizens and folks who were like, I can't pick up music at my age. Yeah. And yet they get behind the piano, get uh -huh. really encouraged hearing that first song that they play. Well, but, and it's true because one of my reasons and my main reason for trying to learn Mandarin is not to speak, <laughs> but to uh, exercise, you know, it, it's my Alzheimer's prevention program. If you're not trying to learn something, you know, it's your mind, a physical body. I run every day for that, but it's the mind that it worries me more about, about aging. So that's why now, if I can learn piano, man, that's another thing to keep those synapses going, right? <laughs> but I'll be able to play in an hour, so that's wonderful. <laughs> well, you're a delight, Sandy. Thank you for being there and putting your effort into this to to help the rest of us and get more out of life. I think that's what life is all about. How much can we eat before we die? How much can we give before we die? And you're helping that with the smartpiano.com. Get the deal now on Indiegogo because you'll never see it at this price again, right? <laughs> uh, thank you so much, Sandy. Take care of your life. Okay.